Am I live? Am I live? Am I live? Am I live? Is it working? Okay. Hey, my beautiful loves, and welcome back to the channel, or welcome if this is your first time. It is Saturday night, and we had an awesome day today. Um, my oldest daughter is, is hanging out with her her friends that came into town and I've been hanging out with my two youngest daughters well my middle my youngest daughter and we went to a chocolate festival today and if you're wondering what in the heck I'm doing I am putting on this and I think I tried this before and did not like it but I'm trying it again this is the uh, blackhead removal mask please excuse my nails if you've watched my previous videos you know I've been going through some problems since I got some this stuff is drying already going through some problems since I got some acrylic nails that was they were literally I swear to God y'all they were put on by super super glue and I've got my middle daughter right here working with me trying to help me make this video while i put this mask on and it literally is drying before i can even get it all the way on my face but okay anyways what are y'all up to on this saturday night it's on my eyebrow it's on my eyebrow my eyebrows gonna literally fall off <laughs> Give me the rag. <laughs> Give me the rag. <laughs> okay, y'all. The one thing I was actually going to do, and I'm going to do this later. I was going to do a, a, a video of like 25 things you don't know about me or something like that. Can you put but, some uh, on me? Earlier, what was that? That was last year. Last year that I ended up trying to dye my eyebrows. If you wonder why my eyebrows... Uh, a blonde matching my blonde streak in my hair because I haven't I haven't dyed my hair and I've been trying to decide if you watch some of my other videos I'm trying to decide what color or what style or what I really want to do with it obviously. but uh yeah obviously but um last year I ended up trying to dye my eyebrows when to take the dye off of my eyebrows and my eyebrow fell off. <laughs> Do not laugh, y'all. It was I'm dead serious. My whole this eyebrow was gone. And it it's like snot. It's literally leaking out everywhere. This stuff. Hold this stuff. I'm not so sure if I like this, y'all. If you've used this before, like let me know. Like I had an applicator. I can't find it, but it's like literally horrible. And it's drying before I can even get it on. <laughs> but um, My face I mean, I'm putting it way too thick in some areas. Because if, see, and it's it's literally peeling off before I can get the rest of it on. Um, Something else you probably may not know about me can is you put that. Can on me? Yes, yeah, so we're going to finish yours in just a second. Is, um, I literally like it's hard for me to see without my glasses like I am literally so nearsighted it's not even funny so it makes very much so sense that I would just rub it right on top of my eyebrow mm -hmm. but anyways like for like three months of last year I had no eyebrow I was wearing hats all the way down over it it was literally horrible y'all like it was <laughs> it was it horrible. Was like, though. comment below, like, your beauty mishaps, or just plain mishaps, period, in general, of what you've gone through in your life that just was, like, so crazy and funny and just kind of out of the ordinary. Me. And, uh, oh, and I wanted to tell y'all a story, too. I just rubbed it on that eyebrow. Then. <laughs> same one. Same no, one. that's the other one. No, I just rubbed one. it nope. on this one. No, uh, no, no, wrong one. Okay. Same one. 
Um, the fact that I can't really see what I'm doing because I don't have glasses on makes this like so bad. And I think I think I might be putting it on too thick or something. It's just like falling off. The other day, my aunt had oh no sent me some clothes. Okay, my aunt had sent me some clothes and. Some of it was some some stuff that I would wear, you know. And some of it was some stuff I just kind of wear around the house. But, um, let me tell you what happened. I put this shirt on and I wore it out. And I got back home and I was literally like... I was literally just chilling in it. I had just washed some dishes and, um... My fiance looks at me and says, babe, like his face literally was scary as crap. And he looks at me and he says, babe, you're turning blue. And I'm like, okay, for real. Until I look down at my arms and my hands. Now, mind you, it was kind of cold in the house. So my hands were already, when I get cold, they turn even more transparent and white. And so... I'm like, oh my God, I'm literally turning blue. I'm freaking out. I'm running around the house. Like, what is wrong with me? I am, he's got my hands under cold water because he's trying to warm me up. It was just, it was bad, y'all. And then come to find out right before I go to head out of the house to go to the emergency room thinking that like I have some kind of circulation problem or something. Literally. Am I done with this? Uh, this this is it. This is all we're Can getting. Can you do mine? Um, yes. Literally. I said, you know what? Let me go get a rag and just see see if I can wipe it off or what's going on. And somehow I started scrubbing my arm to realize that the dang shirt had literally dyed my hands. I had washed dishes, so I was laying down and I had touched the shirt. It died my hands, it died my arms, it died all the way up my shoulders, it died my neck, so you thought that my neck was turning blue. Y'all, yeah. <laughs> it was bad. It was like, so bad. Okay, don't, don't, don't it was so me. bad. Uh, oh, it's cold. Okay, how long? You can put it on. You can put it on your face while we're dilly dallying on because uh this is as good as it's gonna get on mine i wanted to put it under my eyes but i'm not so sure you're supposed to i don't know what i'm doing don't get in my if y'all have ever used this kind of mask before or this specific mask again I think it's by you're only supposed to put it on your nose it's a blackhead but... remover it says apply to skin over areas of concern my whole face is a concern. So I thought, I hope you're supposed to rub this on your whole face. Did you do the kid? I don't know. But you got it on now, so it's too late for all that. Will it help to take off? I can't remember. I just didn't like it the last time I used it. I don't know why I chose this I mask for tonight, y'all. You talk about self-care and everything well we're gonna self-care it up with this mask and see what happens oh your mouth well you hit it okay you know that's about do i need to put it on thicker <laughs> y'all look let me tell you something it has gotten to the point in my life where yeah, I do. I like to go out and enjoy myself as far as but interacting yeah. and mingling. I know it's like up my nose or something. Mingling with, you know, other women um, and going to women's conferences and things like that. But sometimes it's good just to have an amazing day and then come home and have just like a self-care and fun night. Regardless if this mask was supposed to go over my whole face. So, yeah. But, um, you hold this again, baby. Uh-huh. So, 
Let me kind of clean all this up. So anyways, what I was talking about before is we went to the chocolate festival today. I will post some pictures in this video actually. So you can see how the chocolate festival was. And I may do, I've got some other vlog videos that are coming up too. So stay tuned for that as far as we ended up going on a little trip or trail in the woods. <laughs> and got a little lost. And um, I've got the chocolate festival. I've got some other stuff for y'all. I just haven't had the time to get together yet um but the chocolate festival was really nice yeah when do you take it off i'm kind of feeling dry <laughs> i don't know my face feels like it's about to break off see they gave us a little x on our hand when we walked in it was pretty cool um what did you like about it i don't know i liked it it was fun I liked it. I just didn't like the fact that, like, they said that there was going to be, like, all this chocolate you can try and talk about self-care. I was ready to get some chocolate in, you know, maybe a little dark chocolate in there or something like that. <laughs> so I could say that it was healthy. But, um, there really wasn't that much. I mean, it was more like a vendor's event and I, a few people gave out chocolate. They did have a bounce house for the kids. It was cool. It wasn't what I expected. There was a lot of people there. And then after that, we ended up going to the park and just kind of walking around enjoying ourselves. This little mini-me right here ended up hurting our leg at school. And so we ended up this morning. Yes. It's better. Okay, mark it ugly. You can take it off of it now. That's her toe right there. Is that her toe? Yes, that yeah. is my toe, okay? okay. Um, she ended up hurting her leg earlier this week and it just still was hurting so I wanted to make sure that it was okay so we spent the morning in the ER and then we went to the chocolate festival and then we went to the park and she got crutches and we walked all around the park with crutches so yeah we got pictures we have pictures I will definitely post the pictures yeah I just wanted to get on here I'm, I'm gonna try to let this thing dry and see what the heck I am going to do with it. And see if we can get them off after we put them on. I will be stepped like this for the rest of my life. Going but, back to um, school. I just wanted to get it on here, check in with y'all. I'm trying to be more consistent with the videos and just um, letting y'all see kind of what we do. And this is like a mompreneur's. Saturday night, I guess you could call it. Um, I'm literally just oh, yeah, oh. sitting in bed, relaxing, and um, oh, I wanted to tell y'all the other day. Is it this one? The other day I did the top ten tips for um, learning to love yourself and growing your confidence. And actually, in my book, Tainted Elegance, there is a. Uh, 10 tips and there were some ones that I think I kind of left out and so we'll probably do a video maybe tomorrow um, going through those and giving you some more uh, ways that you can really grow your self love and walk in your confidence and if y'all have any ideas on what I should do with my hair on what I should do next. I'm really thinking about going back blonde, y'all. It is so freaking hard to keep up with this red. If y'all have red hair and you, you dyed it red, what what are y'all's tips to keeping it up? Because it is so hard for me. And I love red hair. But my blonde, if you can tell, comes in way too quickly. So yeah. Okay, so for some reason it was like my phone was doing something crazy. I had to put my glasses back on because my phone was doing something crazy talking about my storage was running out, but it's not. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was basically something fun, stupid, just of us trying to put these dang masks on and just give you an update on what we've been up to and so please don't forget to subscribe and subscribe
and 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 like this video give it a nice little thumbs up and hit the hit the notifications bell so that you can get some awesome and crazy content from us because y'all we we are crazy god i didn't know i looked so horrible and nuts in this mask yeah. but i don't even think i put it completely on my nose i'm gonna mommy all right y'all have an amazing and fabulous Saturday nights, and I'll see you tomorrow. Next time. Um, Bye. Tomorrow. This is where I'm at. I can't even get the thing off. <laughs> Definitely gonna watch this video for YouTube. I cannot. Oh my gosh. It's like, oh my God. Wait, put the it's camera like back on me. Or I need to see. Put the camera back on me. That part didn't dry at all. You did that part. Okay. I'm not gonna have a chin left. Yeah, y'all, so I literally had to scrub that thing off. And it's still like all over my face. But that's just an update. And hers, I think, is stuck forever. <laughs> oh, missed the spot. Oh, uh, it hurts. I think I have.